All right, music fans, welcome back. Harmless Dave here talking real music in real time for real people just like you and just like me. Those old time rumors about David Lee Roth. A few years back, I was a little naive and uh, one of my uh, patrons on the channel sent me a message and said, uh, I know a lot of things about the music industry and some of the stuff going on uh, on the inside. And I know some details about David Lee Roth and so forth. And I just listened to what they had to say. Um, this person was a drummer. Uh, she's a good drummer from what I've seen and heard. And uh, her stories were quite interesting because she has interacted with a number of folks who I consider to be great musicians. Um, we both love the band Van Halen. We were talking about the whole Sammy Hagar versus David Lee Roth thing. We started to discuss relationships like how Eddie was with um, Valerie Bertinelli and how Sammy Hagar has had um, a great relationship with his current wife and so forth. And then we started talking about David Lee Roth and she made a statement to me, which I never really considered, but um, I found it a little bit provocative, but, you know, plausible. Uh, David Lee Roth has never had a real high profile girlfriend, uh, or if he did, um, we didn't know about it, or maybe it was back in the 1980s. I don't remember reading about one. Um, it's kind of legend, at least in the Van Halen world, that uh, Dave was quite busy with Van Halen uh, and probably had the whole rock star lifestyle for a number of years. And that most likely included interactions with the ladies. But later on, uh, none of that stuff seemed to be happening. Now you could say, well, Dave has always surrounded himself with beautiful women, right? The videos that he's done and on stage, typically that's the stuff he's done. I mean, he's singing songs like Beautiful Girls. So you got to think, hey, you know, Dave is, you know, the more sort of early Van Halen testosterone thing. That's what Dave is all about, right? Um, well, who would you consider to be more, uh, I don't know, filled with testosterone, Sammy Hagar or David Lee Roth? It's a question uh, you can ask. Well, my rock star friend and uh, associate said to me, look, um, it's possible that Dave doesn't really like the ladies. It's possible. I mean, recently there has not been any sign that Dave is gonna get married or that Dave has a significant other. And it's a question, by the way, that never gets asked by anybody. So Dave, you know, seeing anybody? So Dave, um, do you have a girlfriend? No. Now, I get it. Um, things happen, especially later in someone's career where they just say, what difference does it make at this point if I tell folks? And like Barry Manilow did it. And when Barry Manilow did it, I was like, duh. <laughs> Wasn't like a big deal. I was like, Barry, what took you so long, buddy? Um, but if Dave did it, and I'm not saying this is true or not, but if Dave did it, I wouldn't be all that surprised either. I'd be more surprised with Dave than with Barry, but you know, it's, everything's relative, right? Doesn't really phase anybody anymore anyway. It's just a, a matter of what's been happening in the world. And so you just look at it and you go, okay, um, was it Rob Halford from Judas Priest a number of years ago as well? So it's just interesting speculation. It's, you know, it's a rumor that's been out there for quite some time. Uh, you would say based on his early behavior, say pre-1984 era, no way. But then say after he kind of fell from grace in the 90s and up until now, I would say, yeah, it's, it's plausible. But um, who knows? Will anyone ever ask him a question about this? Probably not. 
it's probably on the, you know, on the condition of interview that you don't ask this question or this isn't, you know, a guy like Howard Stern, you would think would ask David Lee Roth that question, right? Because it would be, it would be a big question and it would be a video that would probably get viewed by many, many people. But, um, you know, just putting it out there doesn't mean I know anything. Doesn't mean I'm sure because I'm not. I'm just speculating like my friend did and uh, we could be wrong. And uh, so that's my video. Anyway, thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. Uh, hit the bell for notifications and please, oh please, Patreons, just a dollar a month. Um, keep this channel alive and kick in for a buck a month and you can interact with other like-minded music people who are kind of in your wheelhouse, if you know what I mean. All right. See you soon.